so in this tutorial we will learn about the potentiometer usage within the multi sim as we know that potentiometers are the variable resistors it is a bit changed from the fixed resistor because we can vary its resistance with the help of an op you can see that some of the electronic devices have some sort of knobs with the help of which we can raise the volumes or some other parameter so usually these are the potentiometers are the variable resistors so in multi sim we will see that how we can simulate a or we can use a variable resistor so for it we need to go to our library then in master database we need to move to the uh, basic okay now we can see here the potentiometer so here we have a 1k potentiometer we can also use a potentiometer with 500 ohm resistor so click on ok and place it here okay now you can see that we have a little slider given through which we can change the resistance of the potentiometer on the output side we need to see the multimeter okay now we need to attach the positive end of the multimeter with the, the with this and a negative a negative end with the with this wiper pin or the middle pin okay now if we want to just measure the resistance of the potentiometer so we just need two pins not the three but if you want to make a voltage divider circuit or if you want to observe some sort of voltage then we need the ground okay so okay now we need to run it okay they said that the circuit is not grounded okay so we can place a ground on this end we can place a ground okay okay now we can double click on multimeter we can go on ohms okay now it is written 100 okay now when when it is at uh, zero percent the slider is at zero then our resistance is 500 ohm then we need to move it we got 475 ohm value then 400 and then like 250 ohm at 50 percent and then 125 and 100 at zero ohms okay now this is just for the just for to see the ohms are resistance uh, that we can vary it via potentiometer but uh, what about the voltage either we get some uh, change cha changing voltages after we rotate the knob so for it we need to go and take our dc power okay so this is our dc power we need to connect it with the top end of the resistor and lower end with the ground okay so this is your okay this is your ground okay wait we need to move it like uh, some bit below like this and now we can connect it with the ground now what will happen the voltage is provided by the battery r12 so when the when we move the knob then obviously the resistance will change more is the resistance then more is the voltage drop as we know that when we move the knob our connector moves on some resistance type strip and when it moves away then the length of the strip get increases so the resistance in return resistance will be increases okay now uh, now we will check that either uh, can we can we get the can we get some sort of uh, changing voltages so for it we need to connect the positive end with the 
with the wiper pen and negative end with the ground okay so now we will see that okay it's 12 volt okay so now we will in okay now we we we, we we move the slider it means that we are moving the knob so we are getting some low voltages so like this okay so 1.2 micro volt is our lowest voltage okay now okay so this is okay obviously if there is more resistance then all the voltages must be dropped so 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 this this knob or wiper pen acts as a changing uh, thing or changing parameter so we can get our value changing value one more thing that obviously this is a fact that all the 12 volts that arise in the circuit must be dropped in the resistor but we just deal with the portion which is from this shaft pin you can see my cursor to this point if like 11.9 voltages are dropped at this point you can you can concentrate on my cursor like this point to this point then all the rest of the voltages if it is 1.1 or not or whatsoever it must be dropped in the left part or the left region of the potentiometer so obviously because in every circuit the kvl is always applied so we just deal with the part which is between the top end and the uh, moving moving pin of the potentiometer so hopefully you got this concept so thanks for visiting our channel